hey guys this is angel bringing you another video on my high desert garden and this one's gonna be on harvesting uh, seed and I'm gonna make this video for a couple different reasons but one of them is because it's very convenient to just have uh, plenty of seed to go around uh, rather than just buying just one little pack of seed where a little bag would you could probably get maybe like 25, 30, 50 seeds in one little bag, uh, depending on how many you buy. And um, it's nice to have abundance, an abund abundance of uh, seed. That way, if you are not uh, successful the, the first time around, you can always uh, replant and uh, disregard the, um, the seedlings that you uh, planted uh, in the first place. So you will always have seed uh, laying around um, to keep trying, keep uh, experimenting on different uh, uh, temperatures and uh, different pots. So it's always good to have lots of it's always good to have lots of seed laying around. And the only way that you can do that uh, is by harvesting your own seed and. Um, Otherwise, if you if you start buying the seed from eBay or or Amazon, you're gonna be spending a lot of money. And literally, literally guys, you're gonna be spending two two dollars and fifty cents for a pack of twenty five to fifty seeds, carrots, uh, seeds at the, at the most. Maybe fifty, maybe seventy five for three dollars and seventy five cents. They give you a hundred seeds for five dollars up to 250 for five dollars depending on the seller but to, to me that is kind of ridiculous so i got tired of uh of spending money on seed so i decided to grow my own and um and that was the reason number two why i don't buy seed anymore and reason number three is because i'm cheap <laughs> just kidding so anyways so um uh, this plant right here overwintered and I let, let it go to seed. Uh, some people call it uh, let it go to uh, let it bolt. Uh, so as you can see uh, this plant some of the seed are already harvested. I made a video uh, this past uh, Sunday but unfortunately uh, I was not able to upload it because it cut out. My phone cut out on me because of the heat so right now it's nice and cool uh, the Sun is coming down it's nice and cool out here so uh, I decided to come out here and make this video that I've been trying to make for you guys so pretty much what you do is you grab uh, scissors you cut the flower I'm sure most of you guys know how to do this but uh, I've been getting some uh, uh, some of my followers some subscribers are requesting for me to make this video. And you can do the same thing with uh, uh, radishes, uh, cucumbers, uh, squash, zucchinis, whatever you want. Just save the seed. So for the purpose of this video, I'm just going to uh, harvest this flower. Bring it to your plate. I'm sorry about that noise. Bring it to your plate. Oh man, look at this camera. It's awesome. I love this Note 9. And kind of rub your rub your fingers inside the flower. And you're gonna see all the seed just dropping in your plate. So that's pretty much all I have for you guys today. And you can do the same thing with your carrots, with your Swiss chard, with your zucchini, your squash, your radishes your uh, kale, your uh, uh, re um, uh, red kale, your uh, dinosaur kale, that I have lots of seed laying around. I wish you guys were uh, lived uh, around uh, nearby so I can give you some of that kale and get ready for the uh, uh, the uh, cold, uh, cold weather for fall because I'm gonna be, I would love to give a lot of that, that seed away. But uh, anyway, so this is all I have for you guys today. I really hope this video was valuable. And, um, and you can use it in your garden. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for subscribing to my channel. And don't forget to leave those likes. And I will see you on the next video.